Welcome back heroes to some more cassette beats. Last episode we went to the mall and we found the vinyl record for Meredith. However, it was slightly different. It's okay though, she likes it. But the floor collapsed and we found another Archangel. Defeated them and then the Triangle Man showed up again and just, uh, I guess, absorbed the Archangel. Today we're teaming up with Felix and we are going to go ahead and head west from here. There's a lot to explore. It looks like, if you look at the, uh, look at the map this bit here it looks like it's starting to get a bit snowy around this bit so that's gonna be kind of fun I think there's a captain around here captain Lowstein is around here somewhere but if we look at the quest log so we have this quest we're gonna try and start doing with Felix which is kind of to the west side uh, we haven't done that yet got the ruin and then got this bit with captain Buffy the land keepers we need to get surf or swim or whatever it is to be able to go over there uh, we can't do this bit just yet because that's quite far away there's Captain Lowstein and Cacklin all the way down there as well. So there's, there's a lot to do. But we're going to go explore the uh, upper left side. Let's see what we can find around here. Get some nice cheery music, which is always good. So let's uh, fly across. Well, I say fly, glide across. I can't find out what these are for later on as well. So there's two altars I've seen. So I think, should I just like jump down? If I just jump down and land on this, uh, okay, let's just, uh, bam, break that. Oh, and don't know what that does, but, hi, you want to battle? You do. Did you know that Cloaksy and Red Castle are natural enemies? I did not. All right, ooh. Let's go Toy Hammer. Are we also going to be using our, um... I must say shroomish, our little mushroom here, I forget what it's called. That was Felix's like monster he came with. Let's see if we can evolve that soon. We've got a campfire just down here, so I'm gonna take this guy out just so we got the easy access. Because I don't want to come back down here to use the campfire and us just be like, oh no, we're gonna lose because we're so weak. So yeah, it just makes life a little bit easier. And even a nice little smack, not bad, not bad. I love the design of this. Oh wow. So this is what we got. Did we get the last episode of the episode before? We got it a while ago. Let's just uh, let's go for a paint swipe. That sounds really cool. Big damage. And here we have a nice little smack. That's fine. Okay, that's gonna fail. Uh, the transfer this coat on the target always goes last. So you gotta have a coating on first and then do it. I see. I'll just go for smack, try and finish it off. Oh, not enough damage. Oh, 133. Ooh. This dude does a lot. We'll quickly just get healed up at the campfire down here. Got plenty of wood to use and oh nice little 39. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Okay, so here is the campfire. We've been to this place before, but I didn't explore any further because I didn't want to like just go around here just yet. So let's rest up. Hmm. So maybe there are some good lessons to be learned from life in Harbour Town. I mean there's not exactly a bustling nightlife, but the whole town relies on each other, so no one is really left behind. There's enough food to go around, but not so much that anything goes to waste. It's cut off from human civilization, but still manages to get by. It's pretty impressive when you think about it. Hmm, it is. Oh, so I need to evolve, finally. Oh, that looks sick. The Decibel, oh, that's a cool name as well. It's very few Decibels have been seen in the wild, Early denizens of New Wirral whispered of seeing white dragons in the cloud, but it's unclear whether they were seeing decibels or just losing their minds. <laughs> Alright, so that's cool. Let me um, box it now that we evolved it. So, party. Put you away. So, put in storage. And we need to bring one out. What can potentially evolve? I think... What I want to try is the bullet. We've seen the evolution, but I feel like it might have a third one. So I'm gonna try that. And I'm gonna switch the team up a little bit. By, not party, switch you with Orchid. Right, so let's go explore this bit now. There's a person over there, oh, hi. I'd love to jump across, but did I make you jump? Not really, I saw you. 
I'm surprised you made that jump though. The uh, across the river, that was quite quite the distance. I think I would definitely not make that. All right, uh, let's go charge. Man, I love our kid. Looks so cool. Revenge. Okay, barely does anything. We're good. We good. I'm not sure if our kid evolves, but just in case it does. So I feel like it's one of them like monsters that could potentially not evolve because it looks good as it is. But if it does evolve, I won't be surprised. Peekaboo. Okie dokie, accuracy down. That kind of sucks. Oh, look at that damage though. Almost taking Jackie out and, and completely. Oh, wow. That is cute. I have not seen that before. A jumpkin. <laughs> oh, no. Jump scare. Okay. Gonna be jumping a lot, I guess. It's in the name, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, another toy hammer that should finish off in the end. Come on, land the attack. Oh, we missed again. I know accuracy's down, but still, you just hope. You just hope you can land them attacks. Nice. Hey, Felix level 39 as well. Sweet. Do need to work on that pounce. Yeah, I think so too. Let's hit this. That does something. There's a uh, never switch here. Oh, there's four switches in total. And we get energy wave and ethereal tape. Sweet. Oh, got a switch. Oh. Okay. Ah. Oh, what? Where are you going? So I need to find a way up. Uh, no, it just keeps going down. I don't have enough time to do this. Oh. So there's got to be... Unless I can do this. Ready? Uh, aha! That's what I want to do. Ooh. And then... So this has got to be the captain, right? Mm. Yeah, Lodestein. I'll move you in a second, bud. I've just got some final repairs to make. Right, all done. Levi Lodestein. Levi Lodestein. I work with the rangers to keep the lights on. Do you want to know a secret? We harness electricity for the town's power grid with these pylons. We really have no idea how they work. Well. My educated guess is that there's a unique kind of uh, background electricity here on Nuburu that these pylons can conduct and store. But these wouldn't work on Earth at all. Not a chance. Earth's atmosphere doesn't work that way. Mm. Enough science talk. You're here to take my Ranger Captain Challenge, am I correct? Uh, yes. Great! Great! This won't shock you to hear. My area of expertise to battle is that trick like... <clears throat> Great! This won't shock you to hear, but my area of expertise in battle is electricity. You have to be quick on your feet if you don't want to be struck by a lightning. Alright, bring it on. Captain Lodestein. Alright, so we shall toy hammer you and charger. Take out the mana spear first. Every time I see a mana spear, I just get haunted by the look of it. Like, I just need to find you down in the Deadlands. I don't know where you are. <laughs> I'll find you soon. I haven't looked for it in a while, but when I do go look for it again, I will find you, I swear. Ouch. Oh, that did a lot of damage. All right, toy hammer again, and then charger. All right, that would definitely take you out. Oh, you just live in, but it's fine. It's fine. We get taken out by the electricity in a second. We get taken out as well. There you are. So far, so good, I think. Uh, let's go Bulletino. Yeah! Right, to a hammer, and then I just guess spit, that's all we really got. Yeah, let's go Bulletino! I've got to get my, um, my cute fire dog off of Kaylee at some point. Because I feel like it might be able to evolve again, and I just want to maybe see if it can. So it might even look even cooler! <laughs> Ooh, good damage though. Nice, nice, nice. 
And you missed my bulletino. <laughs> Alright, nice little spit. Alright, all good. Shocking. You perform better than I thought you would. Oh, I try, I try. Alright, it's toy hammer and spit again. Not bad. Ooh. I wonder if we self-destruct like the uh, the wild ones do when we die. Rapid fire. Doing the damage, man. Gonna find out. No, we do not self-destruct. Disappointing. If only. All right, let's go to brush room. We cannot go into our um, fountain because water. Just, just probably die. <laughs> uh, so yeah, it's just plastic coating. Probably just gone for smack. Would have taken it out. Hey. Toy hammer to finish you off and then paint swipe if we can get it off as well. <laughs> oh, you just get burnt and yep, all good. Any more? Shocking. Nope, that's it. Victory! Ooh. All good. <laughs> that was a pretty electrifying fight, if I say so myself. Forgive me for the puns, it's a force of habit. Nah, man, don't go, keep going, I love them. Go on, here's your reward. Nice. So we're missing number two. No idea where you want to be. So I'd really love to chat a bit longer, but unfortunately I have some maintenance work left to do here. Good luck out there, bud. Thank you very much. Woo. Right, so let me go get healed up. Because we're a little bit weak. Not that do still just like pass down the floor. <laughs> Alright. Let's get this done. So rest up. I wonder if brush room can evolve. Hmm. You want to hear something kind of weird? I used to have a scar on my upper arm right here. I fell into a, a chain fence as a kid and it cut my arm real bad. That sounds really horrible, dude, but it's not It's not there anymore. Ever since I arrived here in New Wirral, I don't know what that means. Just thought it was interesting. Would it come back if I go to the go back home? Makes me wonder. Oh, that is very interesting. Makes me think of, um, oh, there's a thing I watched before with the clones. They were like, any scars that were like self-inflicted or anything like that weren't on the actual clones. Ooh, I wonder if it's like a, a sort of situation. Well, where are we now? We've got this switch here. That just turned the light on. Oh. Oh, hello. Okay, straight into a battle. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Alright, let's do this. That, you're a wind type, so this should be pretty easy. Good damage. Go on, Toy Hammer. Ooh. I reckon it's, it's... Oh, no, maybe not. I say it's possible to maybe take you up before the third uh, tape comes in. But no, bring out Electro-type. That just changes things a little bit. Although, still doing big damage. Ooh. Oh, man, that looks awesome. So that's going to be the evolution of that... Wing Gloom, right? Oh, I love that. Oh, there's so much we got to do. Like, when we get uh, some more tapes, we've got to like, evolve things different ways and whatnot. Alright. Huh? Now I don't know whether I was a man dreaming I was a Dominoff, or whether I'm a Dominoff dreaming I'm a man. I must get a little bit confusing if you think about it like that. Uh, where are we? Oh, I actually do need to catch one of these. Been looking for you. So I feel like these things could evolve into something really cool as well. Alright, so let's record. Water tape. Use it on you, and then a charge. This should easily, easily, easily make it 100%. Oh, it's 100% now, but... <laughs> make it like 200%. There's no way I don't get you. Let them do their moves. 
Nice little spit. Still 100%. And it's ours. Wait. Still 100%, right? Yeah, still 100%. Oh, swimming lessons. Oh, sweet. Is this how we're going to be able to swim? The Devil's Helmet uh, heads not only allow them to breathe in water, but contain an air pocket that helps them float in water. Whereas they are very mobile on lakes and seas. They are a little slower on land. So, this is going to be how we swim. Sweet, you can now swim in water. This consumes your stamina. This is what we've been after. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, so change of plans. I'm going to go and do the Lone Keeper shop then, which is uh, in the top right. Just get that little bit of map filled out as well. I think there's a bit of the bottom right as well we can fill out. Oh, there's so much we can do now. Ooh. I only came here just because... I don't know, I was just following a little path, I wasn't... Ah, oh, dude. Awesome, so now we can swim. And what is this? What's trying to kill me? Oh! A pad pole. It reminds me of a low tad, but cooler. I don't know, I really like this. Okay, I'm gonna make sure I catch this. Uh, let's just go for a water filled tape again. Oh, there's so much to do. And I keep saying it, this game, I love games like this where you just, there's always something to do. And if there's nothing to do, just explore and you can find things to do. Like, this is, what, this is how I feel like I'm going to feel like in two weeks when Breath of the Wild, uh, Breath of the Wild 2. I keep calling it that. Uh, Tears of the Kingdom comes out. But the pad, the pad pole is the larval state of the frilly pad. Residing underwater until it matures, since it has not developed proper limbs yet. It's able to attack with its long tongue, long tongue, which secretes a gluey mucus that can slow down any would-be attackers. Ah, oh, sweet. All right, awesome. All right, let's take you out now. That's the first like, monster of these that we've seen as well. But we know on the left side we got like a uh, graveyard to explore. We got like, a snowy area to explore. There's so much more to explore in this game. There's so many more monsters to find. Was that another altar? Oh, this has got to be like... Where are we here? This is going to be like post-game stuff or something, maybe? Like final legendaries or something? Oh, it's one of these things. Oh, that was easy to do. <laughs> hey! So I, I know where three altars are now. Got to try and rem remember, well, keep in my mind where these are. Right, so... We can hit this. Stop. Oh, this is the, um... The sign post, right? Oh. Okay, you want to fight? That's that's fine. We also provide liquid liquidy for your home purchase. Oh, there must be like a loan keeper shop nearby. Oh, man, there's just so much to do. <laughs> Oh, I love it. I actually love this. It doesn't feel repetitive at all as well. Like sometimes when there's, like, there's a lot of stuff to do, a lot of it's just like an open world sort of games. It's just you're doing the same sort of thing. But it doesn't feel like it. I think it's because like, all the monsters you can, you can find as well and the puzzles are a little bit different. Oh, it feels so good. Alright. I've also got lots of items I can use to like power myself up as well as I got um, new TMs, oh, I say TMs, like stickers. But I don't really want to use it just yet because I don't want to feel o overpowered. Oh, okay, so you've got to be quick. There you go. Right, so we'll come back here in a little bit. Just getting some of the map done. Right, where are we? So we are here. So if I go fast, can I just fast travel like this? I can, sweet. That makes life so much easier. So now we want to go up this way. There's a rogue monster over there. No one there. I'm not going to get distracted. I'm not going to fight you just yet. I want to, but... I'm going to do some things I need to do first. Right. And I want to get that top right bit done as well. Uh, just going to run away from you two. Right. 
I'm not sure how far I can go because my stamina is not. I mean, it's, it's actually doing all right. Uh. Oh, sweet! That actually gets me up. I didn't think that was gonna work. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Wait, is that another new monster? Ooh, ice pack. We'll catch this. Like, I, I think I said a couple episodes ago as well. I was like, I was saying, I wish there was a way to see if you actually need the uh, the monster or not. Now we've got the little, now we've got the quest to like up our, you know, we'll collect as many as we can. We've got a little mark saying that we haven't got it, which is good. Uh, I'm just gonna go for a. I feel like I'm gonna kill it. Just gonna go for an ice tape. I'm pretty sure I one shot the all seer. Fine. That kills you. Oh, we got it. Nice at like 46%. Not bad. So ice pecs have icicle beaks that they use to fend off attackers. In warmer climates, these beaks are known to melt away, melt away entirely, which is why the ice peck is found almost exclusively in the cold heights of Mount Wirral. Sweet. So it looks like, did I see that right? I saying we got 40% of the monsters. Which we can evolve a lot of them as well. I say a lot of them, a few of them. We could probably get about, if we evolve our stuff, we'll probably have about 50%, I'd say, or near 50%, surely. Ooh. Oh, we got Gambit. Hey. Probably won't be using that. <laughs> Alright, so let's jump up here. And that's where we need to. Oh, no. At least we got another shot at this easy. Okay. Hup! Hey, just about making it. Here we go. Hey, oh! If you don't vacate immediately, we'll be forced to evict you ourselves. You can try. You got nothing. I got this easy. All right. Double toy hammer. This game, though, it's one, of these, it's one of these games where, if you've never played Tunic, by the way, I really recommend Tunic, a really good game. Like, when you first play Tunic and you have no idea what you're doing, it's basically just exploring, and you can miss so much, but you can also, oh wow, actually, like, look at that. You can, like, um, obviously discover stuff so early on, but obviously you don't know about it. And I feel like if I replay this game, I feel like I could get stuff a lot quicker and easier. Oh my god, there's so much damage. That's the beauty of it. Like just playing for the first time, you're like, oh man, you can do this, you can do that. Oh, we got the queen as well. Okay, this is actually pretty sick. Uh, all right, let's toy hammer again and just spit. Take out the king, and then we take out the queen. Oh, you're going for gambit, okay. Oh, dude, these like dice attacks seem so strong. Every time I've been hit by one, it does so much. Alright. Let's take the king out and then just do a little damage to the queen if we can. Roll five. Okay, never mind. Really wish we had the self destruct though. <laughs> oh, snaps, Felix, no! Okay. What? Vengeful curse. You're gonna flinch me and oh, okay. That is not good. That's a lot of damage. On the bright side, you're gonna die next turn. There you go. Oh, good. <laughs> hey, we're level 40. Let's go. Oh, we did. We learned self destruct. So we can learn it. <laughs> Sweet. So they ran out, of the, uh, run out of here pretty quickly, huh? Maybe they realized they were totally outmatched. Yeah, they were. Let's go, Felix. Ooh, we're the best. Right, uh, I'm going to fight you on I want to get across here just to see what else we can find. If you miss a payment on your home, we'll freeze your assets up. Please don't. Nice little ice pack. This uh, is fine. Do this and... Might be able to take you out one... I say one turn, two turns, but... You're going to outspeed me. 
That ain't good. What else we got? Uh, let's go Fountess. And spit. And oh, is uh, water effective against ice? Not sure what the water does to the ice. Oh, maybe we can find out now. Let's do this and bomb bomb blast. Easily take you out. Oh, look at that damage! Get out of here. Alright, all good, all good. I do need to find a campfire soon though. Alright, can we get across? Oh. And we can just flee. Don't have to fight these because we got them. I'm also very happy you don't have to like have the monster on your team to use the ability. Oh, maybe I could have made it. I thought that was turned off. It looked like it was off when I um, came in before. I mean, it does look kind of off from here. Yeah, I might have been able to make it across when I first came here. All right, so now that we did that, uh, what else can we do? Quest log. We found four out of a certain amount of officers we don't know. Uh, we still need to go that way for you. That'll probably end up being an Archangel quest as well. So we got three out of eight Archangels, halfway through the captains. Still don't know what that is, but maybe now that we've got a bit of like the swim, I can maybe find it around the watery bits. Uh, need to go that way, need to go that way. Right. Okay, still lots to explore. Like Captain Buffy's in that area there. So let's... I think it's pretty easy to go if we fast travel back to Harbour Town Station. Oh. Okay. And start exploring around here a little bit. What can we find? Don't actually does anything. Maybe we can no. I say jump up onto that. We need to find the blue cube. Oh, that's a that's harbor tab. I said we found a house, but <laughs> uh, oh, there's a lot, a lot of like parkour. Oh, loading the rest of the world. Okie dokie. Oh, this is still harbor town. Okay, I know where we are. All right, so we go down a little bit to get these squares. So we're gonna try and fill out some of the map while we're going through. Oh! I came here because I heard there was a bank. All I see is a river! <laughs> oh, I guess I do love the dialogue in this game as well. It's really good. Alright, let's do this and spit. So there's gotta be another like Lone Keeper office quite close by. Right, that's fine. Yeah, but it does any damage at all. So I'm gonna go bomb bomb blast. And we'll just spit ya. Oh I no, okay good. I thought I did the wrong attack then, it's fine. <laughs> yeah, that's all they got. So we can actually come this side a lot earlier than when we did. Because the on this side you just need the bulletino. So the best way to probably do it is, yeah, we got the Bulletino, then we went kind of north side, so come here straight after you catch Bulletino, do the um, the cultist quest. All right, so what have we got around here? So this is where we would come across. Oh, uh, hello. Phew. Oh, it's Captain. Boy, the off-worlders really make a lot of stuff, don't they? Greetings. Greetings, I'm Skip, one of the ranger captains on New Wirral. I gather and sort all the stuff you off-worlders make that ends up here. Electronics, furniture, you name it. It all gets washed up here, put to good use. <laughs> one world's trash is another world's treasure, after all. Say, Say are you that new tr uh, ranger trainee? One who's got a knack for fighting? I suppose I could take a break from my dumpster diving if you want to take on my challenge. Alright, let's do it. Wonderful. So try to have fun. Don't get too disappointed when I beat you. Alright. 
Must be nice to grow up in this world and not go. like get taken from your world into this world, you know? Oh. Style 1 AP, okay. Uh, let's just go smack first and spit. So level 33, okay. It's not like a. It's not like we're super over leveled as well, which is good. I feel like 33 is like a decent level. I need to try and uh, catch up in Vader. I know where they are. Well, I know where some are. But it was like in the mall. I couldn't catch them because they were ghosts. Uh, let's go torrent. Hit them both. Oh, I don't think that's going to really stop it, is it? Oh, that breaks it. Oh, sweet. Woo. Let's go. That's good. Down does is really, really good. Like, looking at it, I don't think it's going to evolve again. If it does, that's awesome. But I feel like it's designed now just... This is the final form. Yeah, I think that's great. I feel like these two fused together could look really cool. I went for the wrong move. I went fog. Oops. And we're burnt. So fog reduces the accuracy of range attacks that aren't water, air, or ice types. So sweet, I just kind of... Screw myself up a little bit. <laughs> oh no. You're doing well. Oh, no promises to keep going easy on you though. You going easy on me? I don't think so. Oh wow. It's like a tank garbage can. Or like a greeny bit green green bin. I say the green bins are the worst. I I, I always remember to take out the rubbish. But I, I never I never remember to take the green bin out to the curb. I always forget. Flat bin bags, just bam, take them down to the end of the road, all good. Green bin, just forget to get out of the garden, bring it over. <laughs> but it's not often I use the green bin, so it's not too bad. But when I do use it, every week, for like a couple of weeks, I forget to take it out. Alright, I'm gonna do this, and then go for Torrent, and Torrent should take it out right away, right? I missed, that's fine. Corroded, broken. Binnovation. <laughs> oh, I love the names as well. Oh, I've got to spit. Oh, that's good damage. Wait, that's another one down. I feel like he's gonna be number two on the uh, the stamp card. He's so close to the uh, wow. Harbor Town. Wow, you really trashed me pretty good, huh? Maybe I underestimated you, Outsider. You've exceeded all my expectations. Here's your reward. Yeah, it was number two. All right, five more to go. Ooh, as for me, I should get back to sorting out all this stuff. Do people from your world really own so many things? Oh yeah, absolutely. I, can, I can't imagine that kind of life. Yeah, some of us are quite the hoarders. <laughs> right, uh, ooh. Let's do some jumps. Does the stamina go down less if I jump? Uh, I'm gonna end up running out of stamina, but if I can just drag it that little bit of the world just to see. Okay. I'm gonna go across the bridge there. Should I go back to town just quickly heal up? That might be a good idea. Woo! You know, we have, we have done quite a lot today. So you know what? I think it's probably a great place to end this pod off. Let's go inside in case like a little bit of dialogue happens. No dialogue yet. Oh, we got a new rumor. Hmm. Heard the pipers at the farm in the west were having a spot of trouble with their bridge. Well, we're going to head that way anyway, so that's good. That's what we're going to do anyway. <laughs> oh, need to go here to heal up. Any evolutions? Oh, nice. Bulletino. Let's go. So I feel like this is going to evolve one more time. But we've recorded 49 out of 120, seen 79 out of 124. I'm guessing the four is the Archangels, like we can't catch them. Unless they'll be like post game. I feel like that'd be a bit broken using them in fights. Anyway, I think we're inspired right here. Next episode, we'll head west, go and do the bridge, and then hopefully try and do Felix's quest as well. I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Peace.